Danny, what pushed you to develop this machine in Italy? It is not easy to develop such machines. I have to be honest with you. You need to produce it and make sure that it is explosion proof and in compliance with all the safety regulations and requirements uh, for the refineries. We're not talking about the uh, local authorities regulation. We are also talking about the safety, stringent safety requirements of the refineries. So it's not easy to produce a machine like that. You know, a machine that is produced cannot be purchased or bought off the shelf. It has got to be customized, it has got to be custom made to fit the purpose. And I was saying every tank has its own personality or character. So it's very important that you know you have a machine that is able to fit inside the tank and able to carry out the job. Why in Italy? Or for that matter, I think you should say why Giroto? Yeah, exactly. I spent close to one year to find the right people in Singapore who could make a machine like that. And it is not only difficult to make, you need to have a lot of certification that comes together with a machine so as to assure the refineries or the plant owners that the machine is actually certified by all the notable bodies that it is safe to work in such environments. I couldn't find any of such companies in Singapore and in other parts of the world until I met uh, Giroto from Italy. So I decided to go along with them and uh, the first time I met them here in Italy, I was deeply impressed. I have to admit that, you know, they, they were ready to listen to me and um, um, they were prepared to go through great length just to make sure that whatever that uh, they're about to produce is workable in the type of environment that we have. We needed someone who could listen to us. And the machine producer, Giroto, needed someone to teach them or to tell them how to make the robots that they are looking for. So that's the reason why I decided to have this machine made here in Italy with Giorotto.